Okay, I'm so very tired. Oh, oh dear. So I've DA the guitars and now I am reamping the guitars. What I'm gonna do now is send the signal that I recorded out into an amp and record the amp back in again. Sort of complicated but sort of straightforward. But just done with my torpedo reload. Now what I have opted for, I'm gonna try this and see what it's like. I'm gonna use an IR, which is like a fake guitar cab, but I'm gonna use a real guitar head. So that is my uh, Kraken 50 watt. It's on full power, being boosted by a Maxon OD808. It currently sounds like this. So it's the Kraken back in kind of DI, like the Kraken head directly into the computer. And then I have a speaker emulator on it. One left, one right with the Kraken, and then I'll do it again with the 5150. So that's gonna give me left side, so quad tracked. Left side, I'm gonna have a Kraken and 5150. On the right side, I'm gonna have a Kraken and a 5150. I have an issue with the guitars. It's a latency thing. There's something, it's not quite hitting the recording on time and it's not, it's definitely not punchy enough. I'm not sure what's going on. The same problems recording the drums of something out and took us a couple of goes. So I've definitely got an underlying system issue, which is really fucking annoying. So I'm just gonna fucking re-record the guitars. I've wired the amp up. I'm just gonna fucking play it. Fuck all the DI fucking reamp and shit. That is enough. Okay, so that's the guitars done for Sparrow for like the 15th time. It's fucking annoying. I think it sounds pretty good so far. Yeah, so it's getting there. Night 5000 of the guitars. So I pulled up the Yorgo session and I'm now just putting down the 5150. Cool. I'm uh, just entertaining myself by putting some finger tappery overlay shit. Stuart sent me through uh, the bass tracks. Sounds really good. There's a very slight issue, and uh, because Stuart doesn't have the same setup I do, tone wise, 100% because I used this Helix stomp, but he's had to export it, and it exports in stereo, which I don't want. I want it in mono. So I need to find a way. So I did a bit of a mixing sesh last night against my better judgment. I did something a bit different in that rather than use my normal rig. I just got the laptop, sat somewhere different, and used Bluetooth headphones just to get an idea of what it sounds like through consumer headphones. So that was enlightening. Low mids, not quite where I wanted them. So I had a wee fuck about with that for three or four hours. But that was last night. I haven't listened back yet. So that'll be interesting. Because what happens is you mix for six or seven hours and it sounds amazing. And then you come back to listen to it and you've over processed the shit out of it and it sounds rubbish. So I got sidetracked like I always do and I haven't even recorded the clean guitar intro and I haven't recorded the swells because I wasn't sure how I'm going to do it. I've done swells in the past in recordings and I've used plugins and it's it's just so fucking annoying. So I think I'm just going to use my guitar into the through my pedal board and then just stick an IR and use the Kraken again because the Kraken seems to be the tone I'm going for. So this is the plan. Got my guitar through all this shit with the Kraken into my DAW with an IR on it. Oh, it's so good. In the effects loop, a Strymon El Capistan and then a Zedcat reverb. Useless! That's an Argo. Sounds good. Put the two reverbs, sent them to a bus, EQ'd it, brought the sharp end off it, and a plug in on top of that, so it's reverb and reverb. They're sort of stacked up, which is creating a nice cool effect. So, yeah, it's good. So, I'm going to go and do a clean tone now. Right, I don't have any decent clean tone amps. So, what I've done is I've just Les Paul straight into the interface. Yeah, I'll just put a modeler on. Many, many, many hours of mixing. Mix has been okay. Just the usual bottom end issue. Sort of pushed it a wee bit too hard to start with. It was a bit, boo, a bit too low endy because panic and there was none. Turns out there's actually fucking loads. So I've cut it back a bit, and I think it's 
said and lovely. It's done, I think. Mix is done, recording's finished. So I just need to start deciding what to do with it now. In the middle of a pandemic and no gigs.